Hey guys, it's NASCAR Reaction with six laps to go at Daytona. Oh baby. Here we go. Calm before the storm. Here we go. Five to go. Five laps remain. I was going to say, you're right, Brad is very good at that, but I think the run's going to establish behind him with this three car, the nine car, or even further back. You know Denny Hamlin's wanting to get to the front and has got help back there as well. And, and if I'm Brad Keselowski or Michael McDowell, as soon as that three car, I don't know if Michael McDowell can do it, as soon as that three car jumps out of line, I'm jumping right down in front of him. And going back to what you said earlier, what you like about Joey Logano and being in the lead. I like Joey Logano's position in the lead because of the company he has behind Four him. Four to go. The line gets established, whoever it may be, one of those guys behind him, one of his allies is going to have to pull down and block that run and try to attempt their win at the Daytona 500. And when they do, he's still got allies behind him. If he pulls down and blocks that, he has options where he's at with the company he has behind him. At the end of the last stage, when the Chevys made their move, oh boy, Dow moved right down in front of them and gained positions. The Chevys will not be content to ride behind no. the forks to the finish, and that's coming in four laps. And look how hard oh boy. the three car can push Michael McDowell in front of him. He's got plenty of speed. Yeah. And he's Boy. Pushing, he's pushing, hoping that my, Michael McDowell wants to step out and make that move here early. He's Three to go. Say, Come on, man. Go ahead, or I'm going to just keep pushing your rear bumper as hard as I can. And Austin Dillon's already proved that he can do it. He's won this race before. Now, the Toyotas, Kyle Busch and Denny Hamlin, have just one car between them. That is Kyle Larson. Can the two Toyotas get together and make something happen? Oh, boy. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> but back to what you were saying, Clay, the, the mm. best opportunity for Joey Logano is that all those guys have all these different agendas. Oh, yeah. and, and what do they do? They get a run, they move forward, but they actually don't get... Here we go, coming to two to go. To get all the way up to Joey Logano. The biggest thing Joey has to do is make sure that he doesn't get too far out when those runs start happening when they get three wide they stall out and you'll get way out and they will get a hold two of laps the remain he's got for the two car right there that's joey Logano's big gap bj may everybody stay in here though oh boy 20% of all Daytona 500 have ended with a last lap change of the lead. That's not going to change tonight. <laughs> oh, there goes Brad. Joey's going to try and block him. Here we go. We're getting racy. Here we go. White flag. Not sponsored by Credit One Bank. Whoa. Here we go. Boy. Austin Dillon to the bottom. Will Dillon have help? Oh, they come down to block. Joey blocking Brad. Brad, oh, he's going to turn him. Oh, my God. Holy crap. Wow. And Chase Elliott wins it. Caution's out. Michael McDowell might have just won this. Who's far is that? Brad. Wow. Wow. Michael McDowell won this race. Oh boy. Thank God Brad's okay. Michael McDowell wins the 500! Yes! Woohoo! The